Hi, hi. This is how I spent my Tuesday. I attended this national women conference and arriving at the venue. Speaking of venue, if you can guess where this place is, please let me know in the comment section. So getting to the venue, I discovered that the tag has finished, had finished. Like right in my presence, the tag finished. Well, we ended up sitting down and waiting over an hour for them to bring extra tags. And luckily, I got one. Migrating into the venue, this is where um, the governor walked in and they were all celebrated. Mind you, I had not gotten a seat at this time. So I ended up just, you know, viewing around and seeing that we had so many people. At the same time, scouting for a place to meet. This is my friend, my newly found friend that I met and connected with here, a lawyer. So, this lady actually pursued us from her seats. <laughs> okay, that's not how it happened. She says it was the seat of the committee, so we had to leave. This is how big the space was, and we could finally hardly find seats except those seats where, you know, okay, someone is here, you know, you see a bag with a book on the chair. Well, we kept scouting, and finally, my newly found friend found a seat for us somewhere in between we sat down and it was lunch time sorry i didn't capture the food but at least we managed this one i enjoyed it this is the face of all a sat the satisfied face face when you are well fed <sighs> moving on it was time for aerobics and um, we were meant to shake our bodies Instead of shaking our bodies, we picked up our phone, myself and my friend, and started videoing people around. Well, in the words of my friend, she said she wants to have something to laugh about when she watches the camera because truly there were many funny things happening. Let me show you one. So I had to zoom this woman in because. I wouldn't understand if it was aerobics she was doing, but I love her sincerity and the fact that she was just serious of what she was doing. So, at the end of the program in the evening, I got a taxi and enjoyed the type of music that was played throughout, like Fuji kind of mix. And I was just grooving until I got home. So, on getting home, I gisted my family everything that happened and we got down to do some reading and calculating before bedtime. So, my mother went on read some sight words and we were doing me on the other hand, I was working with her numbers. So, this sight word, we have been on it for about a few weeks into a month. But I think for the last two weeks or three weeks, we had not read anything. We just played all over the place. So she had forgotten some. That's the power of consistency. Back to Luwalu Nui and her numbers. I asked my girls to arrange and start counting one to whatever number she could identify. And my baby judiciously or religiously started arranging it in this manner. Well, no pressure. I mean, she's still two and she's just identifying the number, so she's not expected to arrange it in proper order per se yet until maybe months ahead. This is her sister trying to help her or show her how to do it, and of course, <laughs> it was not met without a little argument. Oh, she continued so right now we are trying to identify our numbers six and seven and um, a few letter sounds so this is how our day went um, enjoy or let me just say good night <laughs> thanks for enjoying this short look see you tomorrow for part two bye